Hello everyone, this is Dit, and I'm here to talk about the M2 Carbine. Now the M2 Carbine is kind of weird where it's like an SMG, but not an SMG. And like an assault rifle, but not an assault rifle. It's kind of like in that weird middle ground, where it's almost as good as an SMG in close quarters, and it's almost as good as an assault rifle in medium long range, but kind of the best in between. It's, it's really weird. But aside from that, it's also really easy to use, which makes it the best gun in the game. So let's talk about it. Now the M2 Carbine, it will never 3 hit kill. With stock bullet, it will only ever 4 hit kill regardless of heavy set. So no heavy set, it will 4 hit kill. With heavy set, it will still 4 hit kill. Um, there is a bit of a difference with the bullet, but with the bullet mod, but I'll talk about that in a bit. For the sight, I put on field adjusted sights. It's pretty cheap, it's optional. It makes it a little more accurate once you've started spraying more. But you'll take I'll take what I can get and it's pretty cheap, so might as well put it on there. Now, for rate of fire mods, heavy spring. Do not use heavy spring. Heavy spring doesn't actually change your recoil. What it does is it changes how fast that recoil is applied. So at the end of like one full mag dump, the recoil is essentially the same. Only difference is how fast you got to the end. So don't use heavy spring. The M2 is just the base stock M2. is really easy to control. So just practice with it for a few hours. And get used to it. It is very easy to use. Don't pay more credits to get a worse gun. Anyway, now let's talk about light and spring and trigger. Now, light and spring and trigger basically give you the same rate of fire increase and same recoil increase. The difference ends up being where the spring gives you an extra 3 milliseconds of time to kill over the trigger. And the trigger is cheaper, and the recoil is, and for all intents and purposes, they perform the same. So, field trigger it is. Now, once you do have more practice with the field trigger, like controlling the recoil, and you're ready to go on to the next stage, you put on the light and spring. And at this point, you can basically stop because you've now had the best weapon in the game. If you really, really want to make it better, you could go and put on Jackal Ammo. Now, Jackal Ammo, there is a slight hit to accuracy, but it does 3-hit kill non-heavy set. In my experience against randoms in war, 80% of the population does not use heavy set gold. So, you'll be 3-hitting people with um, Jackal Ammo. So I put on Jekyll ammo because it doesn't really make it that much harder and I've gotten really used to it recoil wise so I just throw it on there and I use it. Now for the barrel, don't use the barrel. It's pretty expensive and it only actually gives you an extra 2 meters of range. So you get nothing and you pay a lot of money for it. Don't do it. Anyway, that's it. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you maybe learned something. Laters.